Oh, this is Pokex Master's face. This is face, this is mask. Pokex is not around. You here? Joining us for a studio session, man. Yeah. Studio sessions, that's what it is, man. Shot is so bad, 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 bad. Lemonade, drip, 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 drip. Burning up the green, 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 green. Pull up with a gang, 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 gang. Shot and make it clap, 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 clap. Bust it, bust it, bust it, bust it over a little spit. It's nothing, 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 get you dripping a little bit. I'm free. This is Mars. Poker in here, man. Ask this. But that was not cool. Yo, this is Mars. We can eat Mars on the beach. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. Face Fosca. You know what I'm saying? AKA Face Fosca. AKA Galavito. AKA whatever you want to name it. As long as I'm cool with you, we I. We made it. We all met ten PhD. Yeah. I didn't know much until I came here. Yeah. Even Parker, the one who's not around, I didn't even know him. We started like coming here, different like, yeah. trying yeah. to find a place to record. And, all that. and we was and very, yeah, we, very young. Yeah. We kept coming and kept coming and kept coming until at the point where his HD decided to like form. A record label, you know, yeah, called PhD Records. So he he chose people who used to come, you know, those ones he knows that they have um, capabilities of yeah making this thing happen. You know, yeah. So yeah, that's that's when we started like knowing each other. That okay, now we are in, in the same label. Yeah, we we now like meeting each other like almost all the time. Became friends. Yeah, now we family. That's so when we family. became friends, like, like brothers. Like, yeah, and then that's when we decided to like um form a a a, a trio. Yeah, called Pockets Mother's Face. Because I remember we started doing a song together. It was actually a song for Pock. <laughs> that was Pockets. Yeah, song. it was Pockets. <laughs> and then he, and then I I had a I had an idea for the hook for the chorus. So I was like, yeah, let me, let me, let me do something. Cause like, yeah, I had something in my mind and it was like, okay, cool. So it was the three of us. It was actually the four of us in the studio cause this was here too. And then I, I gave out like a little bit of an idea. I didn't write it by then, but I had an idea already. So they were like, okay, cool. Go and, go and write the chorus. Then we'll see when you come back, what, what we can do about it. Yeah. Yeah. So that's when we that's decided right. we can do that track like all of us. And then he was like, okay, let's make more songs. Let's make more songs. And then, yeah, that's when we decided on the tape. Then. Yeah. It made so much impact for, for that time. Yeah, yeah that's when people time. started recognizing us because now we, at some point, we started performing it and yeah, it got popular. Good we popular. Like, yeah, that's one of the things that gave us confidence in ourselves that yeah we can start you can actually do it as a, a, a trio yeah yeah that's what started the trio. Mm -hmm. It's very funny. Let's just tell the truth, man. <laughs> we recorded we recorded some of us two in winter. Yeah. All of it. We we was like. Talking about what we memorized the last song. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, it got fun like that. It's like, it's hmm. like a summer, summer, summer type yeah. of music, you know? Yeah. Summertime, everybody's happy, everybody's in shorts, yeah. best. everybody's going on vacations, man. Yeah, that's that's what we're talking it's about. Fun. Also in, in the songs. Yeah. You can have you can you can like like this it's December and you listening to sad songs in a club <laughs> or something? Yeah. Come on, you're not you know, gonna, you're gonna, you're not gonna relate. You're not gonna enjoy. Nobody enjoys the club that plays sad songs yeah. on a December. Yo, imagine. <laughs> so a lot of people are confused by that because like you find Fizz coming up with the with the trap EP, like a solo trap EP. You kind of like.
confused for it. These guys are doing this and this and this. That's heavenly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So to make it clear is that when we're coming up together, we're doing something different, totally different from what we do individually. It's yeah. a whole new sound. You're trying to create a sound that's um, gonna that's gonna um, put like free state. Okay, let me say Bellefontein out there. Like you see this this there's gom and there's like I'm a piano nowadays. So we have our own, you know. Hopefully we really, when it blows, everybody's gonna jam with it. Everybody's gonna be doing it. You know, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah, that my EP is an eight song EP. Yeah, so the um, I guess you want me to talk about the name. Like explain a little now for why I named it. Mm. It's actually MXM, but then there those the M is me and Mickey, it's my ex girlfriend. Long story short, broke up. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know what to say, know man. About that. Yeah, it's something about that. No. Recovering from all of that every day, man. You know what I'm saying, yeah. I was with Mas, I was always with Mas the whole time, you know what I'm saying. And we also like picked out um, a song we did like two years ago, you know, yeah. Comfort Zone. Yeah, I thought about it. The song from two years back it still sounds the same as the sound that's being made now, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Why not? Actually, it wasn't an, an EP when we when started, yeah, when I started, but then. You know, you know the works, man. Don't let good boy go to waste. Actually, like we didn't drink this mixtape, man. It was like something like I was explaining to why I was drinking, exactly, you know, because of I was going through a tough time through that that time I was making, you know. I actually made the first one it was supposed to be a, a a single, just a single song, but then it dope. So the song was dope and all that. But then what happened, my sister passed on and stuff, you know. So through that time, uh, I took the advantage because the Danny Dope was around a lot in the studio. You know, I took it as an advantage. So like, hey, bro, you still know, let's do this and that. Let's see how you sound. Not like I'm extremely mass or easy because I've been, been working with them my whole life, my whole career. We actually decided to make a collab mixtape yeah the other day we was drinking on some dry gin and we got super drunk you know what i'm saying and we decided to make a song about it because we started feeling good about it you know what i'm saying so yeah the whole the thing started. yeah that's how the tape started it's the whole it's like it's the whole everything man. yeah it's so good to do Twenty four seven. Um, twenty forty seven. Yeah, that's the name of the EP. Yeah. So basically, we just started like we just um like figured out we could do something if we we work together. You know. Yeah. Yeah. So that's when we decided to like work on an EP with yeah. Kevin Clark. Yeah. That's that's about it. That's actually a dope EP, man. I've never did something I've never heard. Man. It's crazy. It's yeah. Out of this world, man. It's in 2047. <laughs> exactly. It's in the future. Yeah, something like that. Like that yeah. yeah. It's crazy stuff, man. Uh, it's Starstruck. That one, yeah, it's a solo EP. Starstruck. I did it alone. Yeah. Yeah. There was me, like, um, bringing out myself, you know, yeah, as an individual, because so far we've been pushing as pop x mass x face you see so like we're trying to like combine our styles so that we like we can come up with something new. something new something yeah. different but yeah, yeah we're not trying to so sound like each and every one of us you know yeah, yeah. so starstruck basically means me coming up alone you know uh, it's like that because like i was actually trying to like make people to feel like um they're not entering this other like world or something like that you know so that's why the intro is, is actually like like in a spaceship or at a space station or something so it, you're actually about to take off when you listen to the songs they're gonna take you off 
of where you are. You know, yeah. yeah. You're yeah. gonna meditate over there. Mm-hmm. You know, wherever, wherever it's gonna put you, but it's gonna it's actually gonna Taking put you kind of like out of space. Out of space, space somewhere yeah. else. Yeah. Get your mind thinking. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Thinking yeah. flying cars and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> whatever you're gonna think of. Yeah. That is out of space. Yeah. That's it. Uh, everybody's dope. I like everybody, man. I can't lie. There's this kid, uh, I forgot his name. I was actually with him on the last event I was on. The kid is actually dope. I like that kid. Can you, can you something, man? Can you something? The kid is dope. Yeah. Shout out to you, man. Yeah. Well, I feel like, yeah, people are really dope. They have potential. But then there's something lurking. Ego. This ego, man. Well, like, again, yeah. people don't have like the sound of their own in most cases. They're trying to like do something that already exists. Because sometimes I always say people they should send me the links, and then I'm, I'm like listening to how like everybody's doing their music nowadays. And in most cases, I hear something that I've already heard. You know? Yeah, it's still cool to hear something that you already heard because. But then at least if, if if it could be slightly different, you know, yeah. if it doesn't sound exactly the same way. Add your flavor to it. At yeah. Least. They are, yeah. Yeah. So like there are only a couple of like artists I know that have a different sound, yeah. In what they do. You know, yeah. <clears throat> well, I can say, yeah, it is kind of difficult from where we are right now because I feel like people like from here where we are. They, they they mostly focused on people who are already out there. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that's how we we, we we get to struggle, you know. Yeah. People want to see you out there first and then they're like, okay, he's now really doing it, you know. Yeah. But then on the other side, I'm glad about the internet, you know. Yeah. The, the internet, internet is, is it's there for us. The internet, the internet is life, man. Yeah, it's really there for us. Because you can still find people from outside very far commenting on our stuff like yo you guys yo 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 i've never heard something yeah. like this you know people from yeah. from boo 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 new jersey da, yeah from the uk all these places it's crazy yeah. and then you don't get the same love at home i don't know why it's not it's not like you don't get the same love okay we still get the same love yeah. but then it's really lacking you know <laughs> yeah it's yeah. lurking man. but i like what these people are doing with the events you know yeah people get to they go try. to the events and yeah. then yeah, we get to display our sound and then they're like, okay, this is awesome. But it's not really like a lot of people who who, who are really into like they, their own city's music, you know. Yeah. yeah. They, they, they prefer to go and listen to other people. And those people also, they're still like us. It's just that they're now at a position whereby they are like really up and now, you know. Yeah. Because yeah. they still started like us and then at least they had like... um people supporting them until they reach to where they are. Yo. <laughs> it's a hard question, yeah, it's man. A difficult question. Yo. But then I, I feel like it's not so much to be changed, but if people yeah. can really understand what's music like from the core, if they can like like different differentiate for it, who really does this music? If they like Basa Haipe Mochi just because I, I, I got to, uh, mm. If they can understand for a music and they operate there, I think they would like be much better, you know. Yeah. yeah. And uh, um, I'd say they shouldn't they shouldn't be lazy to pay for promotion, man. It helps. Yeah. A lot. You should invest in your own self. You know? Exactly. You will pay lot. later on. Stop drinking alcohol. Stop getting paid at events with alcohol make sure you get your money right yeah so you can invest in your music exactly thank you very much that's how business is you know we have to grow each other exactly yeah yeah we're not making favors here we're not doing no favors no yeah we're <laughs> trying to make this happen everybody gotta eat you know yeah because at the end of the day it's business like that
um, I'd say to everyone who's watching, take care of yourself, man. <laughs> keep listening to our music. Yeah. We'll keep support. We'll keep, we'll keep delivering more music. Get your family, not your family. Yeah, go get your family to listen. Hey, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. You know what it is. Yeah. Well, no, and big shout out to PhD, man. Yeah, yeah shout out to PhD. We make, we, we like, we're kind of like the yeah. underrated um, record label somehow. But yeah. we, we got the like the bestest music. I don't know. Yeah, we got the bestest music. Yeah. We're killing it. Right in this PC, man. We're killing it's it. It's a whole lot of great, great, great music. Yeah. It's just a oh, matter of time to really like hola, hola, put, uh, put out hola, all hola. <laughs> <laughs> to put out like all that yeah. fire out there and people start recognizing for oh, okay. These guys are really doing it. Yeah. We're really doing it. Doing it for real. And we've been pulling out like we've been doing great <laughs> music ever since. Ever man. since. We've been been killing it. And we're still growing out of that. We've been been getting gigs out of the city. Yeah. Out of the free state. Out of the state. So a big shout out to PhD Records. That's so man. Okay, first of all, me and Fizz we are working on a tape. Yeah. So we wanted to keep it like low key. We just wanted to make a surprise drop, you know, but then unfortunately. Hey. Hey. I don't yeah, know, man. You know, so yeah. And then on the other hand I'm I'm working on an EP, a solo EP. It's actually two EPs, but then the other one I won't talk about because I, I don't know when am I gonna drop it. So I'm just gonna talk about the one that I'm gonna drop right now. It's gonna drop on. I think it's gonna be on the 14th of September next month. Yeah, it's next month. So the name of it is "Be Proud of Yourself." Yeah, and um, it's featuring Kellen Clev, Fizz, Poga, uh, Stony Flair. Yeah, and then yeah. There's, there's a body and yeah. then from there the way. um you don't have anything <laughs> coming up man. you don't have anything in your mind or something nah, like that. Okay, okay and then we have polka trying to like yeah he's, he's working on singles i don't know whether he's gonna do an ep or what but then he's working on singles and then um yeah, he's, he's gonna going he's gonna drop next month late until the yeah, like September first. I I think he said first week of September. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna drop until he's featuring both of both us. Both of us. That song Marcel reminds me of December. I don't wanna lie. Man. <laughs> the song is super late. Yeah, it's reminds a nice me of song. December. It's really good. And he said he's <coughs> shooting when. Yeah, he's also shooting a music video for on twentieth. He September. said it's on, yeah on the twentieth of September. Yeah, yeah. On his birthday, ah. yeah. <laughs> on his birthday, yeah. Oh, so, <laughs> so yeah. And then, as a trio, as Pork X Music is, we have, we have um a song where we feature Kevin Clare. Um, Night is still young. Yeah, the night is still young. Yeah, that's the name of the song. We're not, we're not, we haven't planned yet for now. When are we gonna drop it? But then, yeah, it's on the line. It's on the way. And then from there we're gonna work on music videos from some of those two. We haven't decided yet, but the first one is gonna be for Tajiri. Yeah, Tajiri. Hey. Yeah. yeah. And then yeah, we'll yeah. see from there what what, what hey. comes out. From, we, from there there's no music until next year, please man. Yeah, we're just gonna shoot videos because yeah. actually the, the season is gonna change. And you know summer fest is all about that summer skis, so We've been waiting for the season to change so that we can start shooting. You know? Yeah, yeah. Bim, we can shoot a summer song in winter. In winter, yeah, it won't ah. really make no sense. Yeah. So yeah, that's that's about it. That's about it. Yeah, and then the tape of me and Faze is gonna be produced by me, Easy HD, and also Den Dope. Yeah. And me too, man. Why won't yeah, you let me make yeah, a beat, man? Yeah. Come on. Yeah, you didn't bro. say that, bro. You didn't say that to me. You said that now. You said that now. Hey, I'm not an idea. I can't tell you that. Yeah, man. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Hey, we should go for the robot. Let me just tell you something. 
Abu Mateb, 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 Abu